This work portrayed is about slander, bullying, lies, power, and politics. I created it in 2009 to reframe issues, hoping to be a catalyst for change. This work is created from monoprints nesting on shredded U.S. currency. In the same year, I created a performance titled Unspoken for the Berkeley Art Center to express the anger and dismay that is felt when slandered or bullied. The performers and I expressed these emotions by crushing black and white monoprints with our bodies to create this installation. Conjunctio is the marriage of opposites. This work was created in 2016 as politics were becoming more and more polarized and divisive. These woodblock and letterpress prints mounted on wood panels can be rotated and moved within the grid, allowing for change, compromise, and flexibility. As you can see here, I like to move and get down on the floor. I tend to use every inch of available space in my studio. Here I can be seen preparing to install my work around again for my solo show at Transmission Gallery. This is Around Again, a site-specific installation that consists of 36 8-inch monotype circles. One side gradually fades from black to white and the other side from red to white. The black and white reference is the same as in conjunctio. The red is beautiful, but also a symbol of violence. Speak Truth to Power has long been used as a call for social justice. Here the phrase is translated into 23 languages from friends, activists, and acquaintances. I imagine this phrase emanating from around the world, people unknown to each other but who had suffered from injustice or repression. This work honors all those who have had the courage to speak out. Since 2016, after the November election, I began to create flags flying upside down as an international call of distress. To the Highest Bidder was created in 2018. It's printed on rayon that is then tattered and distressed. The eyes of friends and activists have replaced the stars. In 2018, I was invited by Kala Art Institute to create a public artwork for the windows at Milvia and Addison in downtown Berkeley, California. This work balances my large wooden shapes with rocks and scrap metal. Travel Prints is a series of 16 different photo etchings in a portfolio travel suitcase that began as moments captured casually on my iPhone and transformed into photo etchings. I constantly find myself drawn to vignettes of the familiar and the ordinary, moments across oceans and cultures and political divides. This work was exhibited at the Impact 10 International Print Conference in Santander, Spain in 2018. This print, Territory of Change, was created for a portfolio exchange and exhibition at the Southern Graphics Council International Conference in early 2018. It was based on an actual project in the central coast of California where industrial wastewater was being reclaimed and put back into the stream so that the steelhead trout could spawn. The next three reclamation prints evolved from the previous print as a series of work that came from my observations of various environments, blended with graphic scientific data from actual water reclamation projects. 
This work is about place, water, and climate change. A photo is reimagined in Photoshop to become the photo etching with blind embossed that you see here. These images weave together the importance of where we each live, with all our differences and similarities, sharing a future where clean water will hold a new importance in the overall context of global warming. Climate change is making water shortages occur more frequently. Clean, reclaimed water that is put back into streams, aquifers, and the ocean will help preserve the natural environment needed by both humans and wildlife. Sheltering in place has altered the physical space and the community that contextualizes my art practice. These four dream works were created while in quarantine. They capture the emotional stress of working in isolation while the world is spinning out of control with COVID-19, the ongoing protests, and the political chaos that surrounds us. These prints layer my subconscious, my photographs, pinhole photographs, hand-pulled etchings, and screen prints. I created the first work in the series, first as a photo etching and then as a sublimation die print on aluminum. The following prints are all printed on aluminum. Stillness and movement, repression and freedom, reality and dreams, chance and choice. My work crosses the distance beyond extremes. It's equal parts conceptual and material. The medium is merely an evocation of personal experience, a process that reveals the shifting layers of ordinary life. Difficult choices have long been a part of my work, often appearing abstractly while quietly referencing social justice, betrayal, and struggle.